Hey guys, it's Jem with a hoop move tutorial for the smear. So to begin this hoop move, we're going to start with the hoop behind our back. The hoop is resting on the small of our back and our hands are at 9 and 3 o'clock at an inside grip. We're then going to rotate our hoop, bringing our right hand down to our right hip. Left hand goes up to 12 o'clock. We're going to flip and rotate our hoop to the front. And now we're going to bring our left hand down to our left hip. Right hand on top. Flip it to the back. Right hand to right hip. Left arm is up. Flip it to the front. Left hand, left hip. Flip it to the back. So it's right hand, right hip. Flip. Left hand, left hip, flip. Here we go. Then we're going to speed it up now, adding some momentum, adding some lower body movement, and some upper body movement, kind of bringing our upper body into the motion here, following our smear. And the reason why it's called a smear is notice that the hoop is maintaining contact with my body when it's in the front and when it's in the back. So we're kind of tracing an invisible belt right on our waistline with that hoop. The smear works in both directions. And you might find that one side is easier than the other. So just practice switching. You can add some funky lower lunges here. You can turn with your smear. You can make your smear very fast. You can make your smear very slow. And you're thinking about, it's not quite a Year when we get it going. It's more like when you spin a coin on the table and it starts to wobble right before it falls down. That's the image that this move kind of creates. So it's a really fun filler for your dance flow. It's also just a fun visual effect and super fun to do. So I hope that helps with your smears and have an awesome day.